and Piper together against the Outsiders. It's all tomorrow night live from Moline, Illinois. In addition to those two spectacular main events tomorrow night, how about what James J. Dillon just laid down? Yeah. Mortis to be handcuffed to the ring post when Wrath goes up against Glacier tomorrow night. You said it yourself. You said so, if he's there, he's going to interfere. Something's going to happen. Well, James J. Dillon just come out and, and put a coyotes on that thing. You know what I mean? And being cuffed to the ring post, you can't do a lot unless you can drag that whole ring around and it's not been done before. Hector Guerrero getting ready to match up with the man we talked about earlier, Mongo. Mac Michael. And how about Kevin Green? The other night on Nitro. Lunatic. He, what crazy. No one knew he was there. No. You know, we usually see just in the, in the back in the locker room area, we know who's there and who's not. Yeah. I mean, he was like laying in wait. Yeah, well, we knew one thing. He wasn't playing football if anybody reads the newspaper. The bottom line, he's obsessed That's right. with Mongo McMichael. And Mongo has learned his trade fairly well, I guarantee it. And, and left Kevin Green. You know, the other night, Kevin Green was, like I said before, punching, kicking. I hope you're watching, but the same thing's going to happen to you tomorrow. Well, he better be careful where he says wherever you are because, like you just said, he could be right in the back there. You know what I mean? That's right. Kevin Green, there is no question that Kevin Green wants a piece of Mongo. And it just so happens he's going to get his shot at the Great American Bash. But for Kevin Green, it might as well be here tonight. It might as well have been Boston this yeah. past Monday on Nitro. Yeah. And even when we're finished Sunday night, Mongo better look behind him in Chicago on Monday. Yeah. Oh, uh, Monday Nitro. Wow. What an event it was. Many calls. And by all, all true aspects, the greatest event in the history of wrestling took place in the Fleet Center. And only getting better. Coming up in Chicago at Nitro Live on Monday nights. But first of all, the Great American Bash, summer tradition, the bench clearing brawl now comes to your television on pay-per-view tomorrow night. Them same guys going to be fighting right there on television. Just a word about Boston as Hector Guerrero is the opponent for Mongo. When WCW went into the Great Northeast, in Boston and put 22,000 fans Whoa. standing room only at the Fleet Center. Oh, if Mungo misses a high elbow that time, WCW established itself as the number one wrestling organization in the world, bar none. Argument scores a big body press. One, two, but a two count. Look at the power. Arguments have gone back and forth for years. I got one better now. But there is no doubt about it after this past yes. Monday. Wow, what for? The thing about that is that old adage that you can't beat me in a home ballpark. If you can, you're the world champion. You know what I mean? Let nobody come in here in your home ballpark and beat you. Well, brother, it wasn't only a, a, a tremendous win, but a thumping and a great display of talented athletes we have here at WCW. NWO wise, too. Whoa, no, could this? No, I'm going to tell you what. Whoa. Hector Guerrero is a veteran that has won many regional titles, tremendous athlete, but that's too much power here. Mongo is a little, a little raw, you know what I mean? I mean, he's right. I know what I'm doing. I mean, he's just throwing caution to the wind here. A little bit more intense. Yeah. It's like the day before the Super Bowl for Mongo is what it is. And he's been there, too. Yes, he has. Both of them have. That's exactly right. Here's a big power slam and a cover. And Hector kicked away. Obviously a size advantage for Mongo here. But as you said, Hector, great champion, great veteran. Not backing away at all. And going right after him. And that's, that may be a different strategy. I think with a big guy like Mongo, the, the strategy would usually be to hit and run. Get away from it. Hector Grell has been in there with many giants. Been in big men. And it's taken a lot of them down. I guarantee you. That great fighting Guerrero heritage. Tradition again. We talk about it. And... and Guerrero really needs Mongo to make a mistake, and you can't get him to make a mistake when he's punching you and beating you and, and belly welling you right down the corner like he was doing. There you go. Now can you catch the line? Using the quickness, Hector trying to get back into this one, but Mongo is just overwhelming here. Look at this. Too much power. Too strong. Look at him, muscle him up. Hey, he got him up. Got him way up there. Them, them glitter tights off. Right up there in his chest. Whoa, brother. The big pile driver wins it!
Steve McMichael. Look at him looking. Look at him. You don't think he's watching out? And Deborah celebrate the win here on WCW Saturday Night. And fans, here he is, Dream. Well, that's right. And he looked at him and said, hit me. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Kevin Green showing up everywhere. They might fight all the way to the Great American Bash in Moline, Illinois. Oh, oh, oh. What highway is that? They're going to be on it. Punching and kicking. Snorting and going. Three point stance. Referees are out. See you later. Go, go. Is he wide? Oh, boy. You think he's a little wide right now? Wow. Number 91 is out. One of the most dominant forces in football. And becoming quickly one of the most dominant forces in the life of Steve McMichael. That's some bad, that's bad blood going here, right? I guarantee it. Saturday night. I can see in the eyes of Mungo. And he was looking for him, man. Whoa. Well, he got him. There'll be no referees. He got his coming tomorrow. Yeah, he sure does. He got his coming tomorrow. And there'll tomorrow. be nobody standing between you, Mongo, well, yeah, and him, him tomorrow Why wait till tomorrow? Why wait till tomorrow? Wait till tomorrow? Wow. Jump in there, big boy, and grab some. Mr. Green. Where's he going, huh? That's right. I don't want to wait till tomorrow. That's what I thought. Now. Let's rock and roll now. We'll be back.